chiropractors essentially do whatever they want. Some chiropractors are essentially physical therapists. They're doing either sports medicine or physical therapy. Uh, they could be, in fact, evidence-based, science-based, reasonable practitioners. But their profession is not really properly regulated. They're, they don't have a, a science-based standard of care. Chiropractors essentially do whatever they want. Now, it was invented, literally invented, by D.D. Palmer about 100 years ago. Uh, he observed, or claims to have observed, that by manipulating the neck of a patient, he was able to cure them of deafness. It's a pretty dubious claim given that the nerves for hearing don't go through the neck, you know, so there's no real way that that could possibly happen. But he was also an energy healer, a magnetic healer, and he decided that all disease, always a red flag, all disease is caused by life energy that comes down from heaven through your head into your spine and then through your nerves to your whole body. And so by manipulating the spine, you free up the flow of energy and you cure whatever ails you. That, of course, is pure pseudoscience. That's not based upon anything, any anatomy, physiology, neurology, anything. Uh, it's based on magic, essentially. So when you go to a chiropractor, and pretty much anything can happen. They might just do straightforward physical therapy. They might do magical therapy and tell you that they're gonna cure your asthma by manipulating your neck. Who knows? As a profession, they do not police themselves. They are not evidence-based and science-based, and they do not adhere to what I would consider to be a reasonable standard of care.